Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To change a custom form's design settings in the Form Customization window of QuickBooks Online, click the Design tab at the top of the window. This is also the default page that appears after creating a new form style. The design settings let you name the custom form style, choose a layout template, add a logo, and select colors, fonts, and print settings. To name the custom form style, type its name into the field in the upper left corner of the design settings. To set the form template, click the Dive in with the template or Change up the template link to show the available templates. Then click the template you prefer to show it in the preview at the right side of the page. If needed, to change the logo, click the Add your unique logo or Make logo edits link. If needed, then click the Add a logo button that appears. Then click the plus sign button in the logo window that appears to select a new logo to upload, and click the Save button to close the window. Note that this copy of the logo is only changed within this form and doesn't change the version selected within the Account and Settings window. Also, the color of the form automatically changes to best complement the selected logo, although you can change it as needed. After selecting a logo, to set the size of the selected logo, click a button under the Size setting in the Design section. To set the logo's position, click an Alignment option under the Placement setting. Alternatively, to hide the logo instead of showing it, click the Hide Logo link. To change the form's color, click the Splash on some color or Try other colors link. Then click a color shown or enter your own hexadecimal color code into the field shown. To change the form's fonts, click the Get Choosy with your font or select a different font link. Then use the left drop-down to select the desired font face and the right drop-down to set the desired font size. To edit the print settings, click the When in Doubt Print It Out or Edit Print Settings link. Enter the margin space you want in inches into the top, left, bottom, and right fields under the Page Margin setting. To reset the margins after making changes, click the Reset link to the right of these fields. To use window envelopes with invoices or estimates, check the Fit to Window Envelope checkbox. To include a payment stub, check the Include Payment Stub checkbox. To hide your company information and logo from the form if using letterhead paper, check the Use Letterhead Paper checkbox. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.